in those moments before his death. He was killed so mercilessly that it became impossible for us to identify the dead body. Wasn't one bullet enough for him? That he was showered with hundreds of bullets, his fingers were chopped, a sister doesn't need anything but justice for her brother. It was on Tuesday that Shahid's body was found in a woodland. He had been missing for two days. Villagers dismissed the Indian Army's allegation that he was a militant. Yesterday we went to the police station and we saw army and police officers were having a verbal duel. The police were continuously asking the army to prove their claims of killing militants and in case he was one. Where are the weapons recovered from him? The Indian police, not the military, have opened an investigation into his death. Shahid Bashir was not involved in any subversive and criminal activities. The further investigation will be taken up on this basis only. We will investigate this matter on fast-track basis. I've also ordered a magistrate inquiry. It's not the first time that India's military has been accused of human rights violations and of what are described as the extrajudicial killings of Kashmiri civilians. Those responsible are rarely charged or convicted. Priyanka Gupta, Al Jazeera.